Okay, so what are we? Day four? Day four of curfew. I'm starting to like losing track at this point. Barely joking. Um, so yeah. Whew, it's really cold tonight. Um, I'm really glad I'm doing this actually. For many reasons. Um, but uh, just the activity itself. It's like, yeah, let's go for a walk. Also, today I have gloves because I learned. Speaking of, I'll close them completely. It's like, uh, you know, those kind of gloves that uh, you have the. It doesn't matter. <laughs> you know, little fingers. And you can, like, smoke, I guess, you know. Stupid gloves. Anyhow, why am I talking about gloves? Um, yeah, I want to I wanna keep those um, as authentic as possible. But I want to take, like, a billion takes. Also, it's pretty cold. And the more I stay in the street, the more likely I am to get arrested and get fined. Um, which I feel like it's going to happen. I don't know if it's going to happen tonight, but I feel like it's going to happen during the course of this. I'm protesting, you know, and I don't have the means to pay. So I really hope I'm right, you know. I really hope that what I believe in is actually, you know, what's right. What I do, that's because I really do. Wow, it's really fucking cold. I'm sorry. Yeah, now uh, it's more like uh, minus 20 for sure. God dang. Um, all right, I'm already rambling. It's two minutes in. I want to keep that short for real. Um, so today in the news, I heard that in Quebec, uh, they're bringing the army to help. I think that's just like part of the plan to scare people. Also, since like the New Year's Eve or whatever, like I'm not sure when it started exactly because I feel like I started following the news again and it was not that crazy a few weeks ago, but anyhow, it's literally indoctrinement. It's, man, it's frightening, like legit. Uh, yeah. I don't even know what to say at this point. It's like, people need to hear about this. You guys need to know what's going on in Quebec, in Australia, everywhere. And it's really like you don't see it coming. And at some point, everybody's like hypnotes. And everybody is like crazy. Like, the, the unvax, it's all about the unvax. Like, they're like, what the hell is wrong with people? You know what I mean? It, it, it looks like, it sounds like a cult. It feels like a cult. Everybody has been in doctrine, in the cult, and I guess there's a bunch of people who also feel like, well, I'm fucked now, so you gotta be, get fucked too. Like, you know, like, I have the vaccine, you need the vaccine too. It's like, what the hell? Um, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. It's so crazy. It's so crazy. Uh, there's buses. Explain that to me. Who's going to take the bus if they cannot walk in the street? I don't know. I guess they might think... Police might think that I'm going for the bus or I'm just leaving the bus and I'm coming back from work or something. You know. <sighs> I can't believe that I could be arrested and fined for taking a walk. And in, like in my last video, is it training? Imagine that if I had a dog... I think I was walking pretty much at the same place here. <laughs> if I had a dog, jeez, I'll be able to walk here, no problem, no worry in the world, because, you know, dog matters. Dogs. I mean, my life is less valuable than the one of the dog, according to those crazy bastards. I'm not saying it's more valuable, I say it's equal. I say it's crazy. It's all bullshit. Fuck, 
I'm sorry, I'm really more like in... Uh, it's really cold. It's really cold. I'm super tired because today I started working again, so I got up super early. And I guess now it's like I'm supposed to go to bed and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm supposed to go walk outside, right? I'm not gonna stop tonight. Uh, I'm not gonna stop tonight. I'm not gonna stop any night until it's fucking over. Um, unless they arrest me. I don't know. But at this point, I really don't care. And I know it's, it sounds insignificant, like I'm this dude. I mean, my, my, my videos, my vlog is literally called Journal d'un Kidam, which means like Journal of a Nobody. But that's what I am. I am a nobody. But hey, we're all nobodies. We're all nobodies with phones. And they realized how freaking powerful we were. So at some point they were like, you know what? Facebook, Twitter, all that shit. We gotta stop that because people are actually communicating and solving stuff. And they're out of control at this point. We need to control them. Like, you might think I'm crazy. I'm just like, you know, it's a theory. Call me a conspiracist. anti-vax conspiracist all that fucking the fact that there's people believing it like legit believing it like it's a religion it's legit i've been calling it the covid cult for like over a year and a half i think i mean it's like a cult and it's like they want they want you to drink they want you to drink the fucking punch before they all drink it together okay cool drink the punch leave me alone leave everybody and especially leave the fucking kids alone i'm sorry i must be like in the fucking street yelling like a madman i'm gonna get arrested <sighs> all right so in resume in brief uh in quebec the army's coming it's in uh, one of the region uh, both and basically they're like there to help vaccinate people and they keep complaining that the, in the hospital they don't have enough people you know like like they have to report surgery and shit but like they lack people to work everywhere because of their stupid mandate and they know it's like they're doing this on purpose i know i know once again i'm going too far Ooh. Let her not think too much. Dang, I'm wondering if I'm gonna see somebody tonight. I I saw them, I think two car. Um wow, ten minutes. Yeah. There's two people waiting for a bus, I think, or a taxi. But that's about it. On parle du couvre-feu? Du couvre-feu, couvre ils ont, on a le droit d'être au Ah oh ben oui, c'est ça. Moi j'ai un chien imaginaire. Non mais c'est vrai, on travaille, on fait la fond extérieure. Moi j'ai un chien imaginaire pour vrai. Ah, si j'étais plus riche, je serais un autre sort de citoyen, tu comprends? She's working. There are security working around the building right now. So... Yeah. Crazy fucking world, honestly. And you know what? I'm almost done with my uh, circuit. And usually it takes like 15 minutes. And I'm like not even 10 minutes in and I'm almost home. Uh, all that to say, it's pretty cold. Uh, and no, the asphalt is not like white per se. But that's pretty much like snow. Uh, they are trying to clean up right now. But uh, it's definitely colder than last time. Anyhow, um, I've rambled for almost 10 minutes now, so I'll try to end this like uh, on a good note. I don't remember. I, I was like, I need to plan ahead and think about what I'm gonna say, you know, during those vlogs. But then again, if I think too much about what I'm gonna say, it's it's not real. Uh, so yeah. I don't know how, but I hope some of you hear me somehow. 
that this and my other vlogs somehow I don't know why how but if you can understand that it's not about me this little that that's the point I'm nobody okay I'm literally nobody it's not about me it's about us we're all in this together and this needs to stop and it's gonna stop when we decide for it to stop that was two car two police car by the way so I don't know if they're gonna turn around and come see me but yeah but yeah I was trying to think about something what I was like blah blah thing uh, yeah I guess it's not tonight other, unless they're turning around and they get get to me so I guess I'm gonna keep the camera rolling you know just in case well I think they're gone it's like in my first video that I posted you know I could almost do like a hey let go part two hey let go let go tu sais pas quoi police vient de passer à côté de moi pas on est définitivement passé l'histoire du curfew là pis sans calice comme moi c'est fucking crétin all right so that was my uh, public service announcement to the prime minister to tell him that uh, he sucks basically he sucks and the cop you know cops and me nobody cares about his stupid fucking curfew but uh yeah I guess that's about it I said I said I was gonna cut early but uh you know what this is my house for real it's my house so thank you so much for watching thank you for listening and I have nothing special to say tonight, like legit, I have zero, nothing to say. It's cold out as fucked. But like I said earlier, if some of you somehow get this message, please convince somebody to do something. And most importantly, do something yourself. Stand up. Stand for each of us. Like, stop being blind if you're blind. But I'm sure that, you know, you're not blind. If you're listening to this because there's no there's no way you're gonna listen to me uh, yeah i think i'm rambling 12 minutes love you guys thanks for the support and yeah stay true and uh stay yourself i don't know how the other day was so great the ending was perfect anyway love you guys peace